Hi there, and welcome to Bix Bits, where we unlock the unknown and underutilized aspects of Power BI. My name is Brad, and today we will be looking at how to quickly view your dataset's composition and quality in the query editor. This is a great way to view your data's integrity before loading it all into your report. Let's take a look. All right, where can we find today? Here's some data, great. Let's load up this vehicle data set from two years ago that I probably got from some random Kaggle post. Thanks, Kaggle. Now let's fire that up and head over to our query editor. Okay, click on the view tab and we have some options in our data preview section, namely column quality, column distribution, and column profile. Column quality is a quick way to view how many values in your columns are valid and how many cells have errors or are empty. If you hover over the column quality values, you get this pop-up that allows you to apply changes right here. This can be helpful in investigating and diagnosing errors in your data sources. Who doesn't love that? Next is column distribution, which is a handy way of identifying how many distinct and unique values you have in each column. Also, a quick way to see your data distribution and identify a unique key if you're unsure where that is located. Hover over, click the thing, and boom, we can make our changes here. Column profile. Okay, column profile is an overview of the data contained within each column. We've got our column quality and column distribution metrics here, as well as statistics like minimum, maximum, average, and standard deviation. To the right, we have a bar chart illustrating the distribution of each of the values in our column. Again, just another tool that allows you to profile your data set at a high level. Activate all three of these and you spectacularly evolve into a data quality mastermind capable of indescribable feats of insights and visualization. Thanks for watching.